I'm Tiffany Tift reporting for America's Premier Experts and today we are in Orlando at the Hard Rock Hotel for a very special event. We are honoring America's top 20 experts and today we have with us Tracy Build. Now Tracy, I'm going to have to look down real quick, but you are a sales and customer expert within the healthcare industry. Let's talk a little bit about that and explain it to people. Sure. Um, Basically what I do is I work with companies to help them grow their bottom line and the best way to do that is through acquiring new customers and keeping them as long as possible um, and in the healthcare market particularly within senior housing, assisted living, independent living, skilled nursing, um, that's a big challenge for them, delivering service. Let's talk a little bit about what you do specifically because we were talking before and you said you know you could get 85 percent of your location fulfilled but the goal is to do more and sure. then you have techniques that you help and you guide these these organizations with right sure sure for example um, a, a niche I work in as I said it might be an assisted living community they're meant to be filled to capacity if there's a hundred apartments you want a hundred people living in those apartments but many people settle for basically surviving hitting budget what they need to pay the bills and there's a lot of revenue that stands between, say, 85% and 100% occupancy. So we, I go in and work with them um, with systems to help them quickly fill their buildings and recapture that lost revenue. And it's not like you just walk in and you say, listen, this is what you need to do, and then you walk out. I mean, this is a follow-up. You stay with these companies for years and years. Talk to me a little bit about how important it is for you to make sure that these companies do well. Sure. I'm all about results, first and foremost, um, because we owe that to our clients. But we really have the sales process broken down to a science. We know exactly what it takes to fill these buildings, whether, and it might be home health care, it might be uh, medical supply equipment, it could be assisted living, it could be skilled nursing. But the fact is, if, if you look at, you know, are you getting the customers, are you converting them to sales? Um, so we break it down to a science, and, and typically you can't just come in in a one-day seminar, pump up a group of salespeople and have sales ramp up. You really have to stick with the client for typically a, a year. Most of our clients never leave. We've had them five, six years. Once they start making money, they want to stick around because they want to make more. They want to grow and you get to grow with them. So it's really wonderful. Now let's learn a little bit more about you, Tracy. What makes you an expert in your field? Our results. <laughs> I think that anybody that's investing money in training wants results. Our average client will generate in the first six months of our program about $2.9 million in added cash flow. So the training program is paid for very quickly and you know when we leave and let's say that relationship does kind of end, we feel like they're ready to fly on their own, they're going to continue making that money and more for years to come. So we really teach people to work smart, not hard, um, you know, work less, produce more. We believe in quality of life. Um, but the key is our systems. We have a very systematic process that helps people achieve success in sales. It's not philosophy. It's not great ideas. It's a scientific approach. Either you're going to get the result or not. And we monitor everything through metrics. And we have a lot of motivation, encouragement, and we understand how to get people to want to work towards big, obnoxious goals. So. Because it really is about results sure. and maximizing your sales. Sure, sure. Well, it's a win-win for everybody. If you're successful at, say, filling your building and maximizing occupancy, you're going to have the money you need to provide better services, better nursing staff. Uh, if you need new carpet in your building, you're not going to have to sit there and try to figure out where you're going to get the money. You can replace the carpet. When you have properties that aren't maximizing their revenue, they can't afford to do what they need to do to really keep the customer happy. So the customer's happy because they're getting their problems solved. You're delivering because you have the money to deliver. And the client's happy because they're, they're profitable. They're really successful. Because, to be honest with you, I mean, a lot of businesses really are just making ends meet sure. and tons of people would love to be able to do that you know put in more money to their carpet or to their clientele and that's really what you guys are helping provide sure. well right now in this economy we're in you're either gonna fly or you're gonna sink we've seen many people that are not doing well and they're accepting that because well there's an election coming up there's the economy there's a housing market there's every excuse in the world but if you invest in training and your people and you give them the skills to offset the effects of the market, my clients right now are hitting record sales because they are sharpening the saw while everybody else is busy making excuses and it's exciting. You're a very dynamic woman, I can tell. So it's you don't you don't want to settle, you know, yeah. you wanna strive for the best for your clients. Well, also thing I want to say about that is a lot of people see me come in and they hear sales trainer and they get scared because they think I don't want to learn how to sell. What I really do is teach people how to build a relationship and an emotional connection. In healthcare, particularly, then, then we oftentimes think it's about um, you know what kind of care does mom or dad need. It's really about this is my mom and dad. 
you know, they've raised me. They've been there for me. It's the emotional connection and really coming to understand what's going on in the family and what is most important and what mom wants, you know, out of life, say in the last 10 to 15 years of her life and really connecting and building relationships. So when we talk about sales, unfortunately, that's not natural. Most people don't know how to connect emotionally. They're too busy talking. They just need to shut up and listen to what it is people are trying to say and they'll have a better experience, whether it's home health care, they're in the hospital, whether they're in assisted living memory care, they just need to be heard. So we've been talking a lot about this healthcare industry. Um, for our viewers who are watching, what kind of clientele do you mainly deal with? and so that they know whether or not you'll be able to help sure, them. Sure, My core clientele is the senior housing industry. So, for example, I might work with Capital Healthcare, who has um, everything from skilled nursing to assisted living, independent living, um, CCRCs like the Stratford, which is kind of a continuum of care where you go in healthy and as you, you might go with your spouse and maybe one of you gets sick, you don't want to have to move them 20 miles away. They can just move into a different area of the building and advance in their care level, and you can still see them every day. It keeps people together. It's easier on the children. Um, so, you know, you maximize life. You make the most of it. You're still going to the theater. You're still traveling. But as your health begins to deteriorate, you can move to those different levels of care. And then my last question for you was, is there ever a business that's too small or too big for you guys? No. Because everybody, you know, the small business starts small, and the more revenue they make, the bigger they expand. I mean, we've watched the majority of our clients expand. They might start with four properties, they go to six. You know, we have clients that have one, we have a client that has 340. So it really just depends on um, are they willing to work? We work with the cream of the crop. You have to be willing to invest in your business, do the work, and you'll see the results. So right, Thank you so much, Tracy. Let's, let's also mention your website because I'm sure there's a lot of people that are going to want to find out more information. So let's tell everybody uh, sure. your website. Sure. My website's uh, tracybill.com, T-R-A-C-I-B-I-L-D. Um, they can also reach us at our 800 number, which is 800-640-0688. Thank you so much, Tracy. I'm sure you have a lot to do, but thank you for thank stopping you. by. We really appreciate it. Thanks. And I'm Tiffany Tift reporting for America's Premier Experts.